Oh God, that looks like shit. Hey there and welcome to another one of my videos. In this video, we're gonna be talking about the Fidlock bike bottle system. I think it's a nice upgrade from your standard bottle cage and bottle because it incorporates a magnet and a mechanical locking system and it's just more aesthetically pleasing. And the bottle is a nice charcoal color, so I think it fits with just about any color bike frame. So in this video, we're gonna show the installation and the transformation of this bike from your standard bike bottle brackets and bottles to the Fidlock. Now in this application, we're gonna be using the Fidlock Bottle 600 uh, for this road bike. They have a bunch of different bottles for different applications, uh, mountain bikes, uh, gravel bikes, stuff like that, different sizes. So on their website, you'll see what works best for you. Now Fidlock has a unique locking technology and the bottle itself has a mechanical clasping system along with two magnets that catch with the magnets that are mounted to your frame. So when you're riding, magnets automatically kind of self-align and catch the bottle. And when you go to release it, all you gotta do is twist the bottle and the bottle comes out super easy. And it's just an awesome upgrade to your standard bottle cage. If you're like me, I like having nice shit on my bike. So this is a nice upgrade. I think it looks a lot nicer than bottle cages. And if you don't have your bottles on the bike, you don't see the bottle cage, and you're probably a little bit more aero, so it's a win-win. And with the charcoal color, I think it works pretty much with any color bike frame and uh, can't go wrong. And like most bike bottles, it's meant for water only, non-carbonated drinks. It's not meant for soda or, you know, you know a lot of you guys like uh, riding with beer. Can't do that with this. I guess you could, but you'd leave the top open, you might lose a little beer. Eh be all right. I haven't really heard any complaints about these bottles. I've only heard really positive reviews. Uh, the only thing I've heard that was slightly negative is the fact that uh, some mountain bikers are riding on a really rough trail, might hit a stray rock or something, which would knock the bottle off its cage. I mean, that, that would take a lot of force because you actually have to twist the bottle out of there. And the odds of that happening are pretty slim. So especially in a road bike, I don't think you have anything to worry about as far as losing your bottle. So now I'm gonna show you how to transform your standard bottle cage system, which I have on my old trusty Cervelo here, to the Fidlock system. So here we go. So first I'm gonna start out by taking off the old bottle cages. So next we're gonna put on the Fidlock mount and it's got an up arrow, so it's dummy proof on installation. And when you take off your old bottle cage, you don't want to use your old mounting screws. You want to use the ones that the Fidlock bottle came with. So these are them. And next is installation. Also, before installation, you want to make sure your threads are clean. And I also add a little bit of grease on my threads here. Not required, but this is just something I normally do to lubricate the threads, uh, easing installation and preventing cross-threading. All right, so we're going to do the seat tube first. And the frame mount has a slot, so you have a little bit of up and down play, as you can see here. So you find out your best position and then torque it down from there. Before you torque it down, you put your bottle on there, do a little test run, make sure that's exactly where you want it. And then from there, we'll torque it. Two Newton meters and torque down. And the installation is complete. I think it looks pretty, pretty, pretty good. So there you have it. Here's the Fidlock bike bottle system. And I think it looks pretty good. Definitely a nice upgrade from what I had before. And I think it looks pretty damn sweet. So if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos for more great cycling content. Thank you. Danke. Voila. See you next time.